As we get ready to get to our 2019 travel planned out, have you ever sat down and thought about what you want to get out of your travel? Not necessarily where you want to go, but what do you want to get out of it yourself? Or are you just going to go for relaxation? Do you want to come back a changed person? These are questions I want you to start thinking about. There's a new type of travel sweeping the world right now, and it's called transformational travel. I decided to set out on a, on a journey and, and climb Kilimanjaro. And at the top, sort of went throughout the group. And one after the other, we all just sort of succumbed to this emotion and this amazing feeling of, of being on, not just on top of the mountain, but understanding the mountain meant more. I was in Costa Rica for a seven-week short-term study abroad experience. And while I was there, I was hit by a car. I was lucky enough to survive. But as I was recovering from that, it really gave me a chance to think about where I was going with my life and what I wanted to do. And what kept coming up for me was education and travel. All right, so this is Jake Halpert from uh, Explore, Explo I want to say Explore X, um, Explore X, which is a company here in Seattle, literally just down the street. And for a lot of people who are getting ready to, to, to embark on their 2019 experiences, their travel across the world, you hear this term, transformational travel, and this might be a new term for people. So break it down. Like, what am I looking for when I'm traveling? Yeah, yeah, ultimately I think it's you know, we've we've kind of landed in a place where travel doesn't serve us the way that it used to be. It used to be about exploring the unknown. Uh, and now it's just become too easy. And so, you know, as you as you go into your next journey and you start contemplating where you want to go, you really need to take that journey within and start looking at it as as a process of travel. You know, you break it down into three pieces. You've got your 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 before, your planning piece, you've got your journey itself, and then the opportunity to take those inspired moments, those those epiphanies you know that 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 come to you in travel and and activate change in your life you know really identify who is the new who is the new you right so i mean why do we travel why do we travel I, ultimately uh, you know, I think that we travel to reconnect with self and our value system and who we are, you know, and from that space, that's a pretty sacred space that I think that most people are, are, are really yearning for today, uh, you know, and that, that helps us chart the course for the rest of our lives, you know, understand what's next, you know, are we going to switch careers, do we have to move out of a different relationship, do we want to start riding our bike to work, are we going to be a better parent, right. you know, these, the, the travel's always been this, this great place to just uh, let go and, and, and reconnect with who you are but also reconnect with the world and, mm -hmm. and, and with others and start building you know, those bridges that are so important to overcome in so, so many of the issues that we face today. That was a big thing for me. I remember one year I went to Belize and I was like, I don't want to just go to Belize and do the ocean stuff. I want to try and find a way to make this travel stick in my brain forever. Yeah. And I decided to go off into the jungle and meet a family and help them. And mm -hmm. someone helped me and I was like, wow. I just help this life that is completely different. They've never been outside of their country and I'm coming back more humbled and more of like a well-rounded person. Is that what you mean? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I mean, ultimately it comes down to human connection, you know, and, and you really have to open yourself up. So that's why it's important to take that journey within, travel from the inside out. So then when you are out on that journey, you're really connecting, you're mindful, you're, you're embracing those moments and those opportunities to engage with people, you know, uh, from around the world that, uh, you know, that ultimately, you know, share so much humanity with you, but, you know, completely live in a different way, you know, and that's where that impact is. And then you come back and you share that wisdom, right? You, you, right. you, you can share get it. it. That's, that's key. That it's super key. Key. Yeah. Okay, so real quick, how do I do it? How do you do it? I'm looking at the calendar. I'm like, okay, I got August. I'm gonna go do something. What do I do? Well, you start looking like, why do you want to travel? You know, okay. what, what are you what are you searching for? It's not necessarily about the what and the where. You know, it's more about the why and the how. Why do I want to go, and how am I gonna do it better? It should be tre uh, treated as a practice, something that we that we put a lot of time and effort in. Right? We get two, three weeks That's a it. year. That's four it. Four weeks. Some right? Of us, I don't know, but you get. Uh, but uh, we might Two as well maximize that opportunity, right? Yeah. I want my soul to light up the room everywhere I go. Do you know how to plan my travel for that? Yeah, yeah. We, we, yeah, we got to go somewhere yeah, deep. Yeah. Travel experience that crack open your soul. Yeah, exactly. Okay, so how can mm -hmm. people get in touch with you? Uh, ExploreRex.com. Uh, we're also at the Adventure Hub and Winery just down the street, as That's you said. That's awesome. Yeah, this we is got, good stuff. We got some pretty cool events, uh, you know, once or twice a month to invite the locals in and, and learn about how to, uh, you know, really amplify the benefits of travel. All right, go somewhere amazing, change yourself. Let us know how that happened, okay? This okay. is good stuff. Thanks, Jake.